Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today is another travel vlog. I am super excited because I'm headed to Temecula tomorrow for Shelby's bachelorette party and we're gonna have a freaking blast. <laughs> Let me know in the comments if you've ever been to Temecula. I have never been. I have done Sonoma like very briefly with my mother-in-law. And then other than that, I've only done wine tasting in Washington, which Washington has amazing wine. So the bar is high. But anyways, I'm super, super excited for this weekend, girls weekend, bachelorette party. But before the festivities begin, I wanted to do kind of like an abbreviated pack with me situation. I mostly just want to show you guys some of the super cute outfits that I got for her bachelorette party. But okay, just really quick, the made of honor Haley put together this like itinerary with attire and so let me just read some of the attire things I need to pack first day tomorrow comfy cute casual Friday for wine tasting we're supposed to wear like oranges pinks browns florals etc then we're gonna have a pajama party so just like comfy items and then on Saturday we're doing like a brunch so I need like a greenish gold dress we're doing a pool party where I'm supposed to wear like a pinkish orange swimsuit and then that night we're going out the theme is like diamond and jewels so Shelby's wearing like a silver jewel type of thing as the bride and the rest of us are in jewel tones so I really just wanted to show you guys the outfits I got for all of those things <laughs> this is the dress I got for the jewel tones should I try it on I think I should try it on all right here it is on and I'm freaking obsessed with this <laughs> so cute I hope I have a reason to wear this again one day in the future but that's the back for the day, we're supposed to wear like peachy tan tones. This is option one. This one's super cute. I've had this for a while and I just haven't worn it actually. But yeah, just kind of like a midi dress. So this is option one. All right, and here is option two. This is actually like a two piece set. I just feel like it's like honestly unflattering. So I just kind of wear it all the way up. But anyways, this one is V cute. And also if I don't wear it for Shelby's bachelorette party, I think this would be super cute for my 30th birthday in Cabo as well. And then for the brunch where it said like greens, golds, floral, I'm thinking this dress. Do you have a second option for this one? And to be honest, I didn't realize we were supposed to do like greens and yellow and floral. So this actually fits well with that theme, but I had another one, which I'm just gonna pack anyway, cause you never know. All right, this was the other dress that I was planning on bringing for that brunch. And like I said, I didn't originally realize it was supposed to be like green or floral. Like this one's just comfier, honestly, and more like lightweight, it's like cotton. So I'd rather wear this one, but we'll see like what everyone is wearing for brunch. And then these are the bikinis I'm packing. So this is for the pool day. And since I am bad at making decisions, I have two tops, we'll decide in the moment. And an extra bikini just in case. And you know, I might grab another black top, but I don't know how to only pack for the things that I need. So yeah. Those are the bikinis I'm bringing. All right, that's it. That's all I wanted to show you guys. So next clips should be us en route for the batch party. Can't wait. Are you guys heading to Shelby's to head to Temecula? Got my bag, multiple bags. And I'm gonna be recording on my phone this whole time just because I don't want to accidentally damage my camera. That's actually Chris's camera. And yeah, so I'm gonna be recording on my phone. So I apologize if the quality is not as good as it usually is, but should be an exciting, fun video. Excited to show you guys Temecula, I've never been. It's gonna be a great time, so let's get going.
guys hopefully you've enjoyed watching my temecula vlog so far we're just going to wineries today so we'll try and show you guys some of the wineries and look at all those little like vineyards behind me it's very beautiful here but yeah having a fun little girls weekend and excited to go try out some wineries today here's my outfit hopefully it clears up today it gets a little more warm I'm sorry, I'm still so Thank you. Hi. <laughs> what? So cute! Oh my gosh, this that is, is so real. This is unreal. First off, I just wanted to say that this little wine tasting tour bus by Toasted Corks was super cool. It was obviously freaking adorable inside, and it was a really nice way to get in between wineries throughout the day because we didn't have to worry about driving at all. And yeah, it was just a really cool way to get around and do a wine tasting tour. The first winery that we stopped at was called Masia, and this one was super beautiful. We were kind of the only people in the tasting room, which was kind of nice, but we did get there kind of early. So that's probably why we were the only ones there. And the guy pouring was a sommelier. So it was actually really cool to be able to learn about different wines and experience some of the tasting notes that he was mentioning. After the first winery, we were naturally feeling a little bit more excited <laughs> and decided to have a little dance party on the bus. So that was super fun. The second winery we went to was Vitagliano. Hopefully I am pronouncing that right, but this winery and tasting area was absolutely stunning. There were a few of these man-made ponds throughout the grounds and it was just very lush and green and absolutely beautiful. And actually they were setting up for a wedding when we were there. We decided to just get a couple of bottles here and kind of struggled <laughs> getting our cheers video and cheers photo taken, but eventually we got it with the help of our trusty tour guide we also had lunch here which was provided as part of the tour but after this we headed off to the third winery how are you feeling i feel great what is all your favorite you, thing about reed um his loyalty oh After yet another dance party in between wineries, we headed to the third and final winery, which was Danza del Sol. This one was also very beautiful, no surprise, and we also got bottles here. And yeah, everything was super delicious here. And after that, we decided to actually go ahead and try out one more winery. This was not included in our tasting tour, but this one was called Akash and it was arguably maybe the most beautiful I thought out of all of the wineries in the tasting area where you could sit and sip your wine. There was just beautiful sweeping views of the vineyards and the rolling hills. So I absolutely loved this winery. And that night we stayed in, ordered takeout, had another singing and dancing party as you can tell and then we just played games and honestly it was super chill super fun just girls night in vibes good morning everyone what a fun day at the wineries yesterday was can't wait to go back and rewatch all of that footage it's gonna be comical but today's saturday we are doing brunch this morning then doing a pool day at the airbnb which airbnb is super cute yesterday overall had lots of fun at the wineries they were all super beautiful and just came home and played games last night and got takeout honestly so but uh yeah wrapping up Shelby's bachelorette party it's been so much fun and it's very beautiful here in Temecula How you doing? Thriving. <laughs> 
for brunch that morning we went to this place called small barn and it just had the cutest vibes cutest decorations both inside and out and the menu actually looked super good and the food that i got was not only delicious but it was also very visually pleasing and aesthetic little plate of food i went with the eggs benedict <laughs> Show me life, show me love Make a change, time is up We can wait for better days, but the days won't come Show me life, show me love Show me life, show me love Make a change, time is up Guys, it's been a weekend. Tonight is the Jewel Tones theme. So Shelby's in like a sparkly silver and the rest of us are in any color that would be a jewel. Show me love. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you check out the link above where I've linked my entire travel vlogs playlist.